Yo, what's up? This is part five to my zombie story. Before I start, I'd just like to thank the few subscribers that I have and the people that watch my videos. I'd like to apologize because they're my first videos on YouTube and I know they're not that great. I also like to thank Zombies Commentaries for their their, their support of my videos. And uh, well, today I'm going to be talking about the map five and Ascension. So let's start with five. Five is in the basement. Well, basically, I'm going to talk about the basement. In the basement of the Pentagon, <coughs> many experiments with 115 had been done, and uh, Rick Toffman was involved with these experiments. You know, probably in the 40s. Um, as you know, they created the the goats there, and um, they uh, created the Winter's Howl gun, created better teleporters, and um, all kinds of things. Now, what happened was during oh yes, also I like to mention the VR11 may have been created here. I don't really know, but I do know that the gun was clearly designed for this map, but they they scrapped it and put it in Call of the Dead. Anyway, um. President John F. Kennedy, Robert McNamee, Richard Nixon, and Fidel Castro were having like a meeting, like when I went all hell broke loose and zombies were everywhere. But the most mysterious part is the the scientist, the Pentagon thief, that to steal your weapons. I I don't know who that is. Um, I like to think that it's um, probably Doctor Maxis, but I think it might be Doctor Daniel Clark from the campaign. Due to the fact that he has writings on his uh, lab coat, and those similar writings are on Dr. Clark's face, it's um, very strange. And when you, when, when all four players die at the end of the level, um, they seem to teleport away. Like the electricity goes around them. I don't know what's up with that. Maybe we'll see them again in future maps. I don't really know. But let's get into Ascension. Ten years after Kino de Toten. And now I don't know what happened between this time period. I don't really know, but. They find themselves at a Russian cosmodrome owned by the Ascension Group, and whose leader is you know Nikita Dragovich and those guys from the campaign. You know the Ascension Group, well Group Nine Three Five kind of evolved into the Ascension Group, and um, you know um, stuff like that. And they they uh, made uh, that portable teleporter that I discussed earlier in another video. I think I may have, but Rick Hoffman originally designed it, but then uh, Dr. Gersh stole it and created it. Calling it the Gersh device. And uh, Yuri Savoyski once uh, worked with this um, device, but he was depromoted to work on the space monkeys. So, the space monkeys, well, the, what they did was they sent monkeys to the moon and trained them to harvest Element 115. But the problem is, as you know, Element 115 is on the moon. The problem is, the monkeys would become zombies and stuff, and you know, they were enemies in the map Ascension. Anyway, let's get back to Yuri. Um, Yuri Savoyski was angry because he was depromoted, and Samantha convinced him to kill Gersh with the Gersh device, so he did. I don't know if he is still alive or not. I'm, I'm assuming Gersh is dead. But, um, yes, yeah, Samantha caused the zombies to take over the Cosmodrome, and yeah. Let's get into the Casimir mechanism. Now, I don't exactly know what it is. But I know that Gersh's soul is, is trapped by Samantha. And you know, the crew, the zombie killing crew, Takio and them, they have to uh, uh, repair this device called the Casimir Mechanism. They have to um, collect a generator and all this stuff. It's part of a big Easter egg. But in the end, you do uh, free Gersh, and you get four miniguns, the four death machines. They last for 90 seconds. It was disappointing finished to the easter egg but it is the end Samantha then says come find me um, in a really creepy monstrous voice so you know either there's more to the easter egg but I don't think there is I think that Richtofen figures that she escaped to the Siberian outpost so they decide okay we'll go to the Siberian outpost they um, teleport through the Gears device end up in the Siberian outpost and um and that's a new story for the final part of my series, part 6. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. And um, it's it's only just the beginning. I've got Call of the Dead there. And when new maps come out, I will have a new story. And I uh, hope you enjoyed this video. Have a nice day.